Oh my god! Hi guys, I'm Chloe and I like trying out weird beauty products. I've done a lot of videos where you buy the stuff online and try it at home, but this time I wanted to mix it up a little bit. I'm gonna try out something advertised to me on social media and then something that only a professional can do to me. But I don't wanna drag someone else into this world. Becky? Yep? You busy? No. Come on in. This is my sister, Becky. This is my sister, Chloe. Mm. So what is one beauty product you can't leave the house without? Mascara. I keep seeing this stuff on the internet where it basically just builds fibers on top of your regular lashes and makes them super long. I've seen it advertised so many times and they've these videos, they like do it until they're like dangling. One, why would you ever want that? And two, I want to try it. So we're gonna do it like the normal way, like just try and make our eyelashes look good. And then we're gonna attempt the super scary long tendril stuff. And how do you feel about eyelash extensions? I think they look nice. How do you feel about black and white eyelash extensions? Like a Dalmatian. I mean, you could tell me anything that's on trend and if it's on Instagram, we'll probably believe it. Is it on Instagram? That's where I found it. So there's this awesome lash tech in Vancouver and she was all over the internet when she put out some pictures of salt and pepper lashes. And apparently it's supposed to add dimension to your extensions. Are we gonna look old? Don't know. This is quite a journey we're about to go on. So I think it's time to start with the uh, fiber lash test. Ooh. Bring in the table and chairs. No one's helping us, let's go get it. This is the mascara. Oh, it's Velcro. No, it's not. It does look quite cute though. Look at this little it's setup. It's really cute. Like, like a little coffin for your beauty products. Why are there two things? Uh, Cause one is, I think, regular mascara. It's gloopy. So this is smaller. Does that it's mean- It's a baby it's... mascara. Oh, it's just like, oh, it's creepy. Mine has hardly anything on it. No, me too. It's just like a little furry, no, look, fuzzy. Mine has nothing on it. That's the fiber. You can dip into my fiber. Yeah, Do you want some of my fiber? To. Do I get some? It doesn't fit. Please brush the amazing eyelash grafting solution when it is not dry. <laughs> That's a riddle. Brush extension fiber also from the bottom of eyelash to top. So you basically okay. put the mascara on, then you use the weird yeah, to like hairy build brush. It out. Continue to brush eyelash grafting solution evenly. Why can't they just call it mascara? <laughs> it also comes with some tweezers because apparently when you want to get them really long, you have to tweeze together your eyelashes. So it's like you just have like five big eyelashes. Ew. So Maybe it's like a framework to like a support system. We're gonna take our makeup off now. One, two, three. Here we are, looking weird with tiny eyes. <laughs> After the first application, the next time you use mascara, it's always just the tip. Yeah. As a regular mascara, how is that going? Quite nice, actually. It's very, it's not plumping at all. Oh God, this is really gloopy. I'm wondering if this is like old and shouldn't have been sold to me. Oh no, there's loads of fiber in my eyes. Ow! They don't warn you about that. It's literally like the inside of a teddy bear. How does this make your eyelashes longer? I don't understand. It doesn't go on the end. All it is is making them fluffy. I don't want my eyelashes to be adorable. I want them to be long. Oh, why not as bad? I didn't put that much on. I think you're supposed to do it so like minimally. I mean, I do have very long eyelashes right now, I will say, That's and I've true, only put too. one layer on. Dude, this is like plastic surgery. You're literally building new things on your face. I'm not <laughs> licensed. The fluff is now falling onto the I table. I need... Oh, I put it in the wrong one. Oh God. Everything's marrying. I don't know how many times you're supposed to do this. I guess until you're at the required, your like length that you want, right? You look like someone who's just started doing makeup. I was like... about to say the same thing. <laughs> I was like, I feel like me going to school when I was 12. I like it on you. Oh. Oh, it's in my eyeball. It's very much in my eyeball too. I don't hate it, but I don't think I'd take the time to do it every day. I think it's time to do a super long one. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do the bottom lash on this eye. And you said you wanted to do the top one, right? Yeah, I'm gonna okay. see if I can reach my eyebrow. I wanna see if I can reach the middle of my cheek. This doesn't have to be neat now, so I can just go ham. Dude, this is already going better than the last eye. It just takes you one try at things and then you're basically an expert. Actually. Cancel that, I've already got a huge clump. Oh my God, so much fluff. It's kind of curling into my face, so I can't get it to go any longer. <laughs> you look like an upside down person. <laughs> oh wait, I forgot, you're supposed to tweezer them. Ow, I just pinched myself. That really hurt. I want to get like five big eyelashes and it's not really working. Yeah. Oh, I'm starting to understand the tweezers. This is just what it looks like if you put too much mascara on. I can't get over how horrific I look. But I'm having you, so much yeah. fun. I'm reading it as the Whomping Willow or a Tarantula. Mine is not doing well, but it is a little bit longer than it was. Ooh, it's getting real long. I've got one. I think I'm done. I can feel them hitting my 
almost eyebrow when I blink. <laughs> it's a haunted forest on my face. I just wanted the crazy ones and I'm sad, but I crazy. tried. I wanted the ones that came down here. I didn't hit the cheek. So I don't think this is the worst product ever. I think actually it works quite well. <laughs> I would maybe, may I can't even look at you. I would maybe, maybe use it again. I doubt it because it's just so much easier to just put mascara on, but I still do like this eye quite a lot. I would do it again if mine ended up looking like that. I think it's time to take ourselves to a professional. Yes, I think and so And get too. some lovely eyelash extensions that hopefully look better than this. Let's go meet Joanna. Can we take this off first? Hi. Hey. Hey. Nice to meet you. Obviously, you're Joanna. Hi. I've been a lash tech for about 10 years now. So I'm always trying to experiment with new ways, colors. So what made you come up with a salt and pepper look? Well, we just added a little bit of white to see if it could bring out more texture with the lashes. Like if you see anything with a tattoo, if you put pops of white in it, it really brings out the piece. All right, I think it's time to get started. So first, I'm gonna make sure that her bottom lashes are separated from her top, so I don't glue your eyes closed. I'm gonna get you to open up. So I'm just gonna cover, oh my goodness, your bottom lashes. It'll feel kind of nice and cool. From now on, close, don't open your eyes. Oh God, for three hours. Don't, don't press the red button, but I want to. I feel like I keep wanting to just be like, so, and open my eyes. I'm gonna start off by, um, putting some of the white ones actually on the bottom layer so it's visible when you open your eyes. Because if I put them just on the top, you're not really gonna see them when you open. And I'm also gonna do a cat eye shape for you. So most of the drama is gonna be on the outer corner. So with you, I'm gonna go a little bit more dramatic and put more of both the white and the black just so it's a little bit more visible. So I'm also doing a volume technique right now and I'm actually creating little fans with the lashes. I'm hand making them and I'm putting more than one to each one of your lashes. Ooh. Um, so that just gives you a little bit more drama. Are these getting longer than my normal lashes as well? Yep, um, especially on the outer corner. For the white ones, I'm gonna be putting about four in each fan, and then for the darker ones, I'm gonna go anywhere from six to 10. Whoa, 10? I'm just such a virgin when it comes to extensions. Like, I've never had it done before. And you're starting that with this, that's cool. bold. <laughs> go bold or go home. So I'm all finished with the white layer. So I did just under a quarter, I would say, of her lashes here. So I'm ready to start with the black. So you like make your lashes yes. yourself somehow? Some places use pre-made fans. So it means yeah. that the lashes will already come in the fan shape, but I'm actually making it each time with my tweezer. What does it feel like, Bex? Uh, like a little tiny bird whispering to my That's eyes. That's great. That means I'm doing my job. So we're all done. So keep your eyes closed. Don't get too excited. Okay. I'm still gonna take off the gel pad. It's about time I had a peek at my sisterling. Oh my God, you don't look like you as much. You look like a doll version. <laughs> it's really pretty. Oh my God. Whoa. They look amazing. I love yeah. them. You look like a little dome creature. <laughs> <laughs> you look so innocent. It's hilarious. Well, that's not correct. Do you want to see? Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. I'm not used to seeing us this glamorous. Oh my god, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> wow, that is a lot of eyelash. Oh my god, I literally don't need any makeup. No. Oh yeah, I see the white. Yeah, they're pretty subtle. The white looks so cool. It just gives it like more definition texture. Yeah. No, I'm like a Disney. Princess just brushing her hair. It's crazy how light they are because yeah. whenever I've worn strip lashes, they're so heavy. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, I've still got my little moustaches on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, that was an experience. Quite a lash journey. Yeah. I was a little fearful of getting the extensions. Partly is it, I don't want to want them again. And now I think yeah. I do. But it's almost worth it to see this on yeah. our faces. The mascara, fun in a way of like an arts and crafts evening. This experience has definitely made me like be more experimental with lashes. I feel like I could maybe even do colored next time and not be Ooh. too freaked out. Let's go show everyone. Let's. Bye. Bye. Bye.